and the oldest is 92. The Ministry of Health also says it has started to offer doctors with mental health services to better equip them. The ANC party has ratified its new constitution and unveiled Amani, Nash, Amani Council rather as the party's top political decision-making organ. Party leader Musalia Mudavadi was also sworn in as the party leader for a fresh five-year term. Consequently, under the new constitution, Mudavadi automatically becomes ANC's presidential candidate in the 2022 polls and also bars him from being anyone's presidential running mate. <laughs> At current Nairobi, that's where the ANC party members converge to witness Musalia Mudavadi's given a fresh mandate to lead the party under the new constitution. Also unveiled was Amani Council, a new powerful organ of the party that will shape the future and destiny of ANC. Membership to the council, it will appear, was deliberately elected to reflect the face of Kenya. One of the radical provisions in the new constitution bars Mudavadi from being anyone's presidential running mate unless he ditches the party. The political organ to make the decision is the Amani Council. So it is going to be a very, very serious institution within the framework of the ANC constitution. So be strong, knowing that the challenges are going to be many. And equally, there'll be temptations. But don't falter, don't waver. Let us all be strong. The Amani Council will be mandated to oversee the election process to fill national positions for the various party organs. In the next few months, as we do the process of the election board helping us to fulfill the requirements of ORPP, you will see the kind of excitement that we'll be generating around ANC in all our counties. That will tell you that this is a party that matters. On Wednesday, Barak Muluka resigned both as member and secretary general of ANC. Muluka said it was fitting that the space around Mudavadi is decongested to allow Mudavadi to make critical decisions on the leadership of the party under the new constitution. Some of Mudavadi's harsh critics have accused a group of party haunches and strategists of allegedly making Mudavadi inaccessible. Activities around Mudavadi in the last few weeks have left people asking what is happening at ANC. The fact that every other day there's an article somewhere, either they are criticizing ANC, either they are trying to demoralize ANC, either they are praising ANC, either they are saying something about ANC. That is the message. 48 hours after Muluka resigned, Elu Dowalo, the ANC candidate in the 2019 Kibra by-election, resigned from the party as an ordinary member. In his letter, Owalo said his departure will create ample space within the party and around Musalia Mudavadi to enable ANC strategically position itself without feeling suffocated with his views or suggestions. We are welcoming the move because it's long overdue. We suspected him long time ago to be a Deputy President Ruto Mall in our party. You remember the time he visited Deputy President William Ruto to taint the image of Musalia Mudavadi. He was one of the people who were pushing Musalia to be Ruto's deputy in 2022.